A golf ball is shot 76 meters per second at 30 degrees above the horizon. What is its vertical velocity when it reaches a height of 20 meters? To solve this problem, first we have to show what is given. In the question itself, there are clues which will help us find the answer. These hints are in the same color in the question, in the given box, and in the diagram. The 76 meters per second in red represents the initial velocity. The 20 meters in orange is the vertical distance. The 30 degrees above the horizon in blue tells us at what angle the projectile, which in this case is the golf ball, was shot. And finally, the question asks us to find the vertical velocity in green. Recording the known information allows us to choose an appropriate formula, the fourth kinematic equation, shown in purple, which then has subscripts y to indicate that we're only using the vertical information because the question clearly indicates that we're looking for the vertical velocity. Looking at our diagram, first we have to split the initial velocity into its horizontal and vertical components. The component calculations of v naught y and v naught x are shown in magenta. The substituted values and the solution are in black. Note that the square root can be a positive or negative answer. This is because the vertical height was reached twice by the projectile, once on the way up and again on the way down.